Hello and welcome to Thomas Cook Study Buddies all about studying abroad. Today, let's dive into the topic of Guaranteed Investment Certificate Canada or the GIC. It's an investment scheme for international students offered by Canadian banks. Your GIC account is a short-term liquid investment serving as a proof of funds that make you eligible for a student visa in Canada under the SDS Student Direct Stream program. All the international students in Canada must deposit their expenses for up to one year into a Canadian bank to qualify for a student visa. Students need not submit any additional financial documents to Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada IRCC, as proof of funds to cover their living expenses in Canada. Some important details about GIC that you need to remember are number 1. Overseas students applying under SPP visa category to study in Canada must invest Canadian dollars 10,000 in the form of GIC with Canadian banks. Number 2. GICs are available in Canadian dollars and US dollars. You can rely on a trusted forex brand like Thomas Cook for your foreign exchange needs. Number 3. You will receive a portion of the deposit amount every month for the first 12 months. Number 4. GIC is available in the form of cashable, redeemable and non-cashable GICs. You can get your money back without penalty in case of cashable or redeemable GICs. Whereas, you cannot get your money back without paying a fine in the case of a non-cashable GIC. Number 5. Total deposited amount and interest on the investment will be credited to you at the end of the term. Opening a GIC is beneficial as a GIC certificate acts as a safety net or guarantees the Canadian government that you have sufficient funds to manage living expenses for at least one year in Canada. It's also one of the crucial requirements for getting a student visa under the direct student stream and also speeds up the application process and processing. And don't worry, your money will be safe under Canada Deposit Insurance Corporation CDIC. We really hope this video has helped clear any questions you might have about the GIC. And if it did, don't forget to subscribe our channel for more useful information about studying abroad. Let us know if you have any questions and leave the comment down below for any questions you might have and we will surely get back to you.